What's up everyone, this is All I Talk is Tech, and today I'm going to show you 15 plus ways to save battery on your iOS device. Let's get started. Okay, so me personally, I don't like using big battery packs and power banks, they just take up a lot of space and you gotta charge them and stuff, and on top of using battery phone cases, those you also gotta charge, and they're really bulky and they take away from the good design of the iPhone. So today I'm gonna show you some really cool tricks to save battery. So other than turning down your brightness and turning off Bluetooth and all that usual stuff, I'm going to show you some pretty cool tricks that will help you get a few extra hours out of your battery life. So the first one is go to the widget panel, go ahead and tap on edit, and then from here turn off all the widgets you are not using, and if you don't use any of them, turn all of them off, and this will keep them from running in the background on your home screen and will save you a lot of battery. This next one, go to settings, click on notifications, and then scroll all the way down and turn off amber alerts and emergency alerts. And then from here, what you want to do is turn off specific apps that you don't use, and this will prevent you from getting messages from them, and it will save your battery because the screen won't turn on, and it won't be constantly searching for new notifications. So you will save quite a bit of battery using this. This next one is to turn off Siri, especially Hey Siri. Hey Siri always runs in the background and is waiting for you to say Hey Siri, so turning this off will save you quite a bit of battery life. This next one takes place in Safari, so go to Safari and hold down the tab button and then go ahead and tap on close tabs and then that'll save a little bit of battery as well. And then go to do not track and then turn that on as well in Safari settings and clear your history. Now from here what you want to do is go to auto downloads in iTunes and turn all that off. This next one is in location services, turn all of them off, but if you use specific apps like maps or something, or maybe the weather, keep that on obviously, but scroll down to system services and turn all of these off, unless of course you use them as well. This next one is in spotlight search, go ahead and turn off all of these or the ones that you do not need. So for here, what you will do is just turn them off and then it won't be able to search for apps in Spotlight Search. This next one, set auto lock to 30 seconds and it won't keep your device screen on for more than 30 seconds. This next one is increase contrast. So you want to go to accessibilities and then from here what you want to do is tap on increased contrast, tap on reduce transparency, darken colors, and reduce white point. And you'll now see my dock is gray. Before it was matching with the wallpaper, so now everything will be gray. Also go to reduce motion and turn that on as well. This will reduce animations. And then from here what you want to do is turn off vibration. So every time you get a text your phone vibrates and there's an actual motor in your iPhone that moves. So every time you get a text that weighs battery. So turn that off. Along with LED flash alerts that is a really bright light and that can drain battery if you're constantly getting alerts and stuff. So turn that off and you'll save power. And of course and last but not least turn on low power mode. This will save so much battery and also make sure you always have your battery percentage turned on so you can keep track of how much battery you're using and how much you have left anyways that's going to be about it for today i got a bunch of really cool videos coming out so stay tuned for those and as always peace